The funny thing about being from NorCal and living in SoCal is it's kind of like the in the Valley of the Blind, the one-eyed man is king type deals. For instance, everyone here is too afraid to drink out of the faucets. Like I just take my water bottle and go into the bathroom and fill it up in the sink and drink out of it. And it honestly tastes fine, but everyone has like a heart attack just thinking about doing that. Like they have to go to this super special, it's not even a drinking fountain. There's just like in the wall in the lobby, there's a place where you can fill up your water bottle and it's supposed to be like safer, I guess. And I guess I look like just some ridiculous hick anytime I drink out of a regular water place where there's water. Another phenomenon that NorCal kids are not familiar with is that in SoCal, when it rains, the world actually comes to a halt. While visiting friends in SoCal once, my dad referred to their sudden fear of the water that was falling from the sky and their inability to drive during it as Drizzle Watch 2010. Having said that, I just had to walk from the other dining hall and back to eat, and um, it would appear I've become spoiled. I'm no longer prepared for the rain, mentally or in any sense. It's a little bit hard to tell, but my shoes resemble sieves at this point. That's where the hole is. It's in the same place on pretty much both shoes, which is why the water just wicks right in. They really have the watertight capacity of like, water itself. It's kind of like, you guys know when you go to the fair and there's like, those fish bowls that have actual goldfish in them, and then when you get them, they give it to you in a bag and you have like, I don't know, a few hours to put it in a bowl before it kind of like, dies. Well, walking around in these shoes to get to the dining hall and back was kind of like wearing those bags to walk around in. It was a little bit like wearing shopping bags full of water. Now, normally something like this would be a good opportunity for me to just crawl into bed and call it a night, but I still have that paper to write, which means I'm fresher than a mother.